Some time after Gohan defeats Cell, the now grown-up Gohan travels to meet Vegeta and discuss participating in the World Tournament. Vegeta agrees to take part in the tournament. Goku, who is in Otherworld, also decides to participate. In order to beat Goku at the World Tournament, Vegeta begins training with his son Trunks. Okay, if you can punch me in the face, I promise I'll take you to that amusement park you're always going on about. Really? You mean it? Here I come! Now let's just see what you can do! He may be a Super Saiyan, but he's still a child. No way in hell I'm letting myself get hit. Come on! Eat this! Eat this! For you. Wow, Dad. I can't even lay a finger on you. But I'm not giving up that easy. You're taking me to that amusement park. Stupid. All right. That's enough for today. That was amazing, Dad! You've got to be the strongest guy in the whole world! <laughs> Naturally. Even through my greatest hardships, I've never let up on my training for a single moment. Yeah! I can't wait to watch you dominate at the World Martial Arts Tournament! But... I still wanted to go to the amusement park. Dry your tears! I'll take you to the park, okay? Aw, oh, yeah! But you're going to keep on assisting in my training, while maintaining your Super Saiyan form, of course. Oh man. And I was gonna hang with Goten later. This sucks. At the World Tournament, Vegeta reunites with Goku. As a result of the draw, Vegeta is due to fight Goku in the first round and is finally able to take joy in battle. However, during Gohan's first battle, Yamu and Spapovich invade the battlefield and take to the skies with Gohan's stolen energy. Vegeta immediately joins Goku in following Spapovich's trail. Before long, Yamu and Spapovich are killed by Babidi, and Dabara has turned Piccolo and Krillin to stone. To turn Krillin back from stone, Vegeta and the others follow Dabara and fight him. But as Vegeta watches Dabara and Gohan fight, he becomes frustrated at not being able to fight Goku at the World Tournament. So, Dabara and Ba Bidi seize on Vegeta's selfish desires. Submit your mind and body to me! <laughs> <laughs> Bob Biddy detects the wickedness that remains in Vegeta's heart and looks poised to use it to manipulate him. Can Vegeta overcome Bob Biddy's brainwashing? Oh no! 
Vegeta! Don't let that creep control your mind! <laughs> Vegeta! I... I... <clears throat> Babidi's casting his spell on him. Come on, Vegeta! Stay with us! Silence! All of you! Just... Who the hell do you think I am? You... You fool! You're dealing with the proud prince of all Saiyans! And you actually believed you could control me?! What?! <laughs> he broke Babidi's mind control with his own will! The only thing I care about is fighting you, Kakarot! Now show me the results of your training in the afterlife! Right now! And I'll demonstrate how much I've outclassed you! I bridged the gap to meet your natural talent! And after all these years, I'll prove I'm the strongest of all by beating you in one last decisive battle! That is my goal! My sole purpose to fight! You keep on surprising me. After what just happened, I can tell how much you want to settle the score. All right. Let's you and me finish this once and for all. Hold everything. Nobody denies becoming my servant. That's it. Now you all die, Deborah. Yes, sir. And for insulting my pride, I'm going to crush you all and throw you into the wind! You were a fool to think you could control me! As you wish, Master. He's far stronger than we presume. No enemy has ever been an actual threat to me. And yet, you're starting to sweat, demon. Have you been taking this seriously or not? For trying to make a prince serve the likes of you, it's off with your head. As Vegeta defeats Dabara, his energy can no longer be absorbed to revive Majin Buu. Curses! Now I can't siphon any power, and Dabura has bit the dust! Ah! Majin Buu won't be revived if I'm slain! Time to make a hasty retreat! Oh! So you think you can just run away after humiliating me? <laughs> it's over for you! <laughs> Get up already! Get away from me! <laughs> It's done! Majin Buu's container is destroyed! 
And with Tabura gone, everyone who was turned to stone should be back to normal. What a relief. I am eternally grateful to all of you. And Vegeta, your sheer force of will ensured the safety of the universe. Save it. Protecting the peace is of no interest to me. All I did was push aside another fool standing in my way. That said, how much time is left? Oh, right, right. We gotta get back to the stadium quick, before the tournament's all over. The tournament is inconsequential. You and I are going to fight before this day is done, Kakarot. Vegeta and Goku hurry back to the stadium, but the tournament has already finished. However, the announcer who remembers Goku's past fights agrees to make special preparations for him to battle Vegeta. As he and Goku enter the arena, the moment Vegeta has been waiting for finally arrives. Sorry for the long wait. It'll be worth it. And now I'm going full force, Kakarot! Whoa, whoa, hold up, Vegeta! If we go 100%, we might cause more than a couple of problems. How so? Like, if I were to use a Kamehameha or go Super Saiyan here, the whole town would be destroyed. Remember, our friends and family are here too. Beat him, Dad! Go for it, Vegeta! <laughs> Very well. Then this shall be a battle of raw strength alone. Gotcha. For so long, my only ambition has been to defeat you. This is it, Kakarot. Today I will prove who's the strongest Saiyan warrior of all! My goal was out of reach when you left this world behind. But my training never ceased. I was convinced the day would come when we'd face off again, Kakarot. And with it, my victory would be in hand. Kakarot! 
Vegeta! I've ever seen Vegeta, and you earned this win. This concludes the World Martial Arts Tournament Exhibition Match. Please applaud the marvelous efforts of our two fighters. When the match concludes, Goku and Vegeta are met by their families, but Goku has only a short time left in this world. As fortune teller Baba arrives to lead him away, Goku asks her to wait and says goodbye to his family and friends. In addition, Goku reveals the Super Saiyan 3 transformation that he couldn't show Vegeta during their fight. Vegeta is shocked that Goku has hidden his new power. To his frustration, he knows that he hasn't really beaten Goku at all. Duh! You were still hiding even more power? A little but in terms of pure fighting ability, you've totally surpassed me. I got a lot of training to do in Otherworld. Hey, you know what? You should come hang in Otherworld too, Vegeta. There are strong fighters everywhere you look, and you can train as much as you want. Are you stupid? I have no intention of dying yet. I swear you never stop aggravating me. But you better not let up on your training, Kakarot unless you want to lose to me again. <laughs> Win or lose, you never change, do you? Well, goodbye, Vegeta. Next time we fight, it'll have to be in the afterlife. And I'll win then, too. For I am number one. All right, that'll be it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please like, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. I greatly appreciate it. Thanks for watching.